dudes and dudettes. How are you guys? <gasps> this is Chazzy and I am here to ask all of you formally to stop requesting that I stream games on Twitch and Mixer because it's not gonna happen anymore, okay? So this video is over. This is Chazzy signing out for now. As always, I will see you guys in the next video. Okay, but now let's, let's, let, in all seriousness, guys, no, seriously, stop. Stop asking me to stream. It's not gonna happen, okay? It's really not because I really don't like it, all right? Welcome to What's the Damage, and today I'm going to be explaining to you guys in very utmost fashion, trying not to lose my patience with this because it is something that irritates me a lot. I'm going to explain once and for all why I do not stream games on any streaming platforms, okay? There are actually a number of different reasons, and a few of them are related to tech, you know, or lack thereof. Tech. And also some personal reasons, you know, I actually don't really enjoy it too much, but let me explain why guys, okay? Now, as you should know, and if you don't, well, you're going to find out now, I play a lot of games on this channel, you know? I have an entire, uh, it's, it's, uh, I have like a, a playlist where there are sub playlists, you know, uh, called Chazzy Plays where uh, you guys can access that tab on my channel and see all the playlists of the games that I play. There's also a random games tab where you guys can see a bunch of stuff that don't have uh, episodes and multiple playthroughs. But anyway, the point is guys that I love video games. I really do. I do a lot of gaming content on this channel. I would go on to say that the most amount of videos on my channel are actually gameplays. If you sum up all of the games that I have, the, the random games, the individual playlists, you're going to see that they're quite there's a lot of gaming content here on this channel and also my other one so anyway by the way subscribe to my other channel please chazzy and faye the spin-off channel this one where i do so content that's very similar to here but anyway now i i know that at this moment like the biggest gaming platforms right now are twitch and uh well actually just twitch no, nobody streams anywhere else except for youtube but i'm pretty sure twitch took over now a lot of people stream games on twitch by also doing it on, on youtube and sometimes people just do it on twitch and they actually make a living out of it you know it's very common for a twitch streamer to have millions of followers who get and get a lot of views and he actually makes money uh, pretty much similar to youtube okay i admit that i don't know too much about how streaming works but I guess they make money when a lot of people watch because of ad revenue or something like that, you know, and apparently it pays more than YouTube and that's why a lot of YouTubers themselves became streamers, you know, like for example, Ryan Higa, even though he uh, used to do kind of mostly skits and sketches and now he's a Twitch gamer. But anyway, so the point is that there is definitely a market for the streaming community, you know, a lot of people tune in to watch streams every day, every week, every month by their favorite creators. So, and it's very interesting because it's a way for the creators to connect with their audience live you know and uh like uh, in, in real time as they're playing a game they can react to the comments no oh, no i don't know how they can like talk to so many people at once because sometimes there are so many comments you know we're talking about hundreds or thousands you know but anyway the point is that i understand why and how streaming is very popular but i personally do not like it you know i have tried to do it in the past you know i, I tried to twitch uh, i tried to twitch on stream <laughs> i tried to stream on twitch but because all i have is an xbox one and a very uh I'm not gonna I'm not gonna talk smack about it because I love that thing my computer but it's not exactly like a, a modern day sleek computer that can actually run streaming so I have a very I have very limited resources when it comes to streaming you know so uh, the quality would always be horrible and it would always be really crappy my my, uh, my headset uh, the audio would come out all uh, garbled you know all muffled so and uh, I actually used to try to do gameplays for YouTube while streaming like I would stream the game and then I would import it into my computer and edit it and tweak it and then I would post it to my channel but as you guys can imagine the quality was horrible um, I've actually been I'm in the process right now of re-recording certain games you know like to replace the ones that I had back in the day with the really crappy streaming qualities you know so but uh, it's it's a long process it's painful you know and I, I i probably like i'm definitely going to be doing a lot of other games you know but uh, i will never delete the old games but i kind of like they're kind of embarrassing you know so i hope you guys never go back and watch them but at the time it was what i had until i found out a new uh, a new way to create my gameplays that made everything just have such a better quality now here's the thing now because i have very 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 few resources to actually pull off a quality stream and my internet is good but not good enough that i could give you guys like a pristine hd quality stream in 1080p or 1080i mostly because my tv is 720 so i i'm very limited when it comes to this now if i had the resources to would i stream probably not 
Let me explain why. To me, streaming is, well, obviously it's much easier than YouTube, you know, but it's harder to set up, you know, get everything right, you know, and try to make it go smoothly, do a little green screen, try to make everything be perfect so your audience can be entertained. But yeah, like there are people who have a very basic setup who actually make it uh, work pretty okay. But the reason that I don't like streaming is that I actually like to edit my videos, you know? Like, I know that YouTube is not the same thing that it was some years ago, you know? I think that actually streaming is much more popular now. There are many creators who are migrating over to, to Twitch. I tried to stream with the mixer at one point and the quality was slightly better and I did a few gameplays here on the channel for that, but it's still a far cry from what it is today with me doing the actual gameplays in the way that I do, which is a little bit more work, but at least like the audio quality and also the video quality comes out much better. There's really no comparison at all whatsoever. But the thing is that I actually like to have the raw format of a video, like, you know, take the video itself and uh, like put in my little intro that you guys know that I have an intro for every segment on the channel, my little outro telling you guys what to watch next and subscribe, you know, and you can't do that with streaming, you know, because yeah, of course, yeah, you can take the stream and then later upload to your channel but that's just more work in my opinion you know because it's, it's it's just weird like if I could do face cam I definitely would I would try to record myself you know my face to show you guys my reactions in real time to the games that I'm playing you know if I could I would definitely do face cam but I would not stream if I did like let's say that a bunch of you guys wanted me to stream something I definitely would for you you know, I would definitely do it for y'all, but like I wouldn't do it because I enjoyed it to pass the time or anything, you know? I always enjoyed YouTube. I've been doing this for five years, guys, you know? And it does get easier, you know? Even if my videos are, are becoming progressively harder to do because I, I'm trying to, uh, sometimes it's the little things, the little details, like me getting the lighting right and doing the, and uh, focusing more on me, trying to disfocus the, the, to blur the, the background behind me, you know, uh, giving you guys outros and intros, you know, a bunch of stuff, different editing. So uh, it, it does get easier because I've been doing it for so long, but I am trying to always push myself, you know, like whenever I go through 100 videos, whenever it's like, uh, you know, okay, 300th video special, 400th, 500th, between those 100 videos, there's always something new, you know, I'm always trying to push myself and give you guys better kinds of content that I couldn't even have dreamed of doing back when I started, you know, so, uh, and maybe one day I might I might start streaming if I have a, if I have better resources and kind of like interrelate them to my channel. But I like, because the thing with streaming is that I know that it is possible to do this, but many streamers they just stream once and it's over. You know, like if you didn't catch the stream, you will never see them playing that specific time. You know, like uh, like I don't know something really crazy happened. You know, during a stream, and if you didn't watch it, you didn't watch it. You know, and you can still see the stream itself if the creator decides to make it public you know like or if somebody else would happen to be screen capturing so sometimes streamers will twitch and then they, they'll post maybe highlights on their channel or something but to me it just kind of loses the essence you know because when you have a YouTube video, you know, you can watch it over and over and over again. I still watch old Markiplier videos, man. I probably watch, I probably seen him playing Cuphead and getting over it and uh, Super Mario Maker like a dozen times each or half a dozen, you know. But even, the point is that it's there for you to watch whenever you want to. A twi like sweet, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, streaming is not the same thing, you know. So to me, it's always been like I know that it's not a very popular opinion, but to me, it's just obsolete, you know. I don't enjoy doing it. I don't watch creators unless it's like a friend who says, "Hey, I'm gonna be streaming later. You want to come watch? Sure, I'll go. Uh, I'll drop a comment in the chat, you know. I'll go to just to help them out, you know. But I don't really consume Twitch a lot, you know. Even if it's a creator that I enjoy, like for example Ryan Higa, I'm just I'm just not a big fan of it in general, you know. Another thing is the quality, you know, like uh, like me doing YouTube videos the way that I do right now, you know, like there, there's a whole behind the scenes process that I will try to explain to you guys later in the video, but like the, everything that I do is to ensure that I have the best possible quality where I am right now, you know, so like I, uh, the gameplays is the same thing. I try to give you guys some HD gameplays, you know, I, I record my videos in a with a professional camera, even though it's made for photography, so sometimes the lighting looks a little weird, but I try to give you guys the best that I can with what I have where I am right now you know and it because like a streaming require if I tried to stream the quality would be so vastly inferior to what I'm doing here right now you know and it also usually when you stream you have a better preference for PC gaming and I'm not a PC gamer at all you know I respect PC gaming you know I know that sometimes it can be better you know 
You can save money, get games on Steam, sometimes for free, even though I have Xbox Game Pass and all of the games are pretty much free, just gotta pay for the service. And uh, usually when you stream, you need a very, very super powered PC, you know? You can stream from a console, but obviously the PC is gonna beat any console when it comes to streaming. So, you know, I, I need a really crazy gaming setup, you know, two different monitors and a microphone capture card, you know? It, it's it's just really, uh, it's crazy, guys. You know, I need a webcam, so it's I can't afford that crap, right? now you know and even if I could I don't think I would invest in that I would definitely invest in a better in better equipment to record you know a better PC to edit the videos and stuff but I don't know I think that streaming it would be like I'd be trying to take on too much stuff at once you know I'd be getting my hands full so I'm not a big fan because of this, you know, and I refuse to stream. Like my friends, like the, the people who, I have a couple of friends, some uh, relatives who watch my gameplays, you know, and they're always like, man, you should get into streaming, you know? There's a bigger market and it's more fun, this and that, you know? And it's not gonna happen, guys, you know, stop. You know, I mean, I've told you all, you know, uh, in private, but I'm gonna say it here, stop requesting that I stream. It's not gonna happen. Because even if I wanted to, I do not have the resources to do that. You guys know this. You guys know that I do not have the tools to give you proper streaming. So why do you keep asking me to do it, you know? Jeez, it's not gonna happen. I'm sorry, maybe one day, but for now, I'm just, I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay format that I use right now. You know, it's very complicated to do, but I've actually gotten the hang of it. So to me, it's pretty easy. I'll explain later in another video. Maybe I'll do like a behind the scenes thing showing you guys exactly how I record. But, you know, it's just, uh, it's one of those things, you know. It's actually really funny how my videos, like if I if I were to make like a, a compilation, like how, how I record versus how the video comes out, you guys are gonna see that it's really freaking hilarious how I set everything up to record my videos. But I think that's it, guys. I wanted to get this out there for what's the damage, explain why, because there have been a lot of people actually like outright requesting that I start streaming, you know. So I'm just going to explain why it's not gonna happen, you know. Hopefully the title, you know, why I refuse to stream isn't gonna be too rude or harsh, but it is, guys. It's I refuse to stream at least for now so maybe in the future when I start streaming if I do I'm gonna refer back to this video saying ha ha I was such a dork but anyway that's it guys if you happen to like this video or if you don't like it if you want me to stream like or dislike it doesn't matter it's going to help the video grow anyway subscribe to my channel because I release videos literally every single day sometimes one sometimes two depends on how much work I can get done and I never announce what times I'm going to be releasing them so it's better to hit the notification bell to know exactly when they're gonna be coming out and that's it, guys. That's it for now. This is Chazzy signing out for now. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Roll that outro screen. Here we go.